Well, I'm very impressed uh, by the organization and uh, the excellent quality of the speakers that you have invited. It's obviously a very positive step forward, I think, for your organization to focus on the professionalism. I'm impressed with the hard work that has achieved already in the last few years. Uh, although there's also a pitfall, you have to be careful uh, not to burn yourself out because people really have worked hard to put this on a very high level. And uh, yeah, use the expertise of the, the people around you and I think uh, you will also feel the support today that uh, people are supporting Aprotka and uh, Spanish Atcos on the way forward. And I think it's a very important step, this seminar also, to make the connection with other providers, with other people that have a warm heart for Atcos, but also to make the connection within your own uh, organization. Uh, to organize this together with your control and IENA support to do this, I think it's a positive step forward. Uh, so uh, I'm quite happy to be part of this uh, today. Myself, I work in Maastricht. Uh, the, the whole management is male. It's a very typical male culture, ATC. Uh, very much in control, power, uh, authorization. Um, it's obvious that they are lacking the, the feminine energy, which is about harmonization, making connections, building the bridges. I think uh, yeah, the men are maybe a little bit out, there, out of their comfort zone to look at the female energy, but I think the best leadership that work in every organization would be balanced leadership. And it's very masculine oriented. And uh, I was very pleased to see the energy of uh, Guadalupe today uh, as vice president of Apotka. It's obvious that she brings um, a special touch in your organization and uh, I think you need it because the feminine energy is mainly about the connection and, and building bridges. So uh, yeah, I'm obviously in favor of that. 